Here's the question. If someone sends me an email to my Google Workspace or my Gmail account, and I forward that email on to someone else, and then I go reply back to the person who originally sent me the email, well, those two know that I'm engaging with both of them. Let me show you what I'm talking about. Let me go get an email, have an email sent to me. Give me a second. All right, an email just got sent to the uh, Burris Consulting at Gmail from this account, which is teddyburris at gmail.com. Let's go look at that email. Here's the email I got. Now, the question is, if I forward this on to someone else, will TL Burris or Teddy Burris at gmail.com know that I did that? So let me forward this email on to someone else. So I just forwarded this email that I got. Again, I got this email right here from Teddy Burris at Gmail. And I just forwarded it to Teddy T.L. Burris at Burris Consulting. Now, will Teddy Burris at Gmail know that I sent this to that other person? The answer is no. They have no indication. Let me go back and look at his account. Here's the email he sent to me. Or, to, you know, he sent this email to Burris Consulting at Gmail. There's nothing on here about, you know, T.L. Burris at Burris Consulting. Nothing at all. Now, let's go back and respond back to it. Hang on a second. Let's say that I respond back to this message right here, which is the original message that he sent to me. I can hit the reply button right here. Dude, good to know. Send. Now you can see that here's the original email message that I got from Teddy Burris at Gmail. Here is where I forwarded it privately or quietly to TL Burris at BurrisConsulting.com. And here is where I replied. And by the way, you can see it's a forward, has the FWD right there. And then you can see I replied because it has the RE right there. And I replied back to TL Burris uh, at te to Teddy Burris at Gmail right here. And there's the reply. This is the message, we're planning on paint the vehicle, a confidential email, and here is where he, uh, where a Burris Consultant at Gmail replied, R-E. Again, there's nothing in here about Burris Consultant at Gmail forwarding that email to anyone else. Now, you gotta be careful if you're taking an email that someone doesn't want you to share with another person, and you share it with another person, and then you respond back, Make sure you don't inadvertently forward or respond back to the wrong message with the wrong words. But Gmail is not going to call you out. Gmail or Google Workspace is not going to let anyone know that you sent or forwarded that message to anyone else. The only way they'll know is if you make a mistake. I just thought of another way that the Gmail user or Google Workspace user may know that you forwarded that email on to someone else. If they're using an email tracking tool like Streak for Gmail, which is free, or any other pixel-based or, uh, or Facebook pixel-based application to track when you open the message and what, what region, city, state, or whatever you are in, they may see that you open that email out of, you know, somewhere in North Carolina, and then they may see that you also open that email out of, you know, New York City, and they know you're not in New York City, and they know you, they sent that message only to you. So be careful, because if they're tracking, then you, uh, you may get caught using that email or sharing that email in ways that they don't expect you to do. I'm Teddy, your Google Workspace and Gmail guy, and I hope this is helpful for you.